In this video, I'm going to show you a technique of how we can create consistent character all across AI video. Let's say if you have one model. So for that, first of all, what we need to do is we need to generate that avatar or that character. And for that here, I am using ChatGPT. So let me ask ChatGPT, generate a blogger character that will be wandering all across globe. But what I want you is I want a PNG of it without any background. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to create a character and I will let you know at later stage why we are doing this without any background. Okay, so seems like this is not realistic one. So let me again ask. I need a realistic character with extreme details. Maybe you can also generate a different poses of it. And the reason why I ask it uh, to have different poses because, you know, not every time you would like to go with or you would like to start it in same pose. Sometimes you want your character to sit, other time you want him to walk or do something else. Because every time whenever we're going to create this kind of consistent video, your character will be doing several things. So this blogger will not only just walk, it also may do other things. So this is one character. Maybe I can download it. I'm going to create another character by asking, by adding this picture and then saying, use this picture to create front pose and the character needs to be exactly same. And now let's see. And here we can see the character looks exactly same. And in this way, you can always add pictures as a reference image and can ask ChatGPT to create more character. And let me again save it. One is like this and then another one is like this. Now, the next thing here we need to do is we can use platform like Canva and then we can create a frame. So let me quickly click here on create and then I'm going to click on custom size and here we can enter, let's say 1920 by 1080. Now let's click here on create new design. Now I'm going to import the picture here in this and then probably I will be adding a background here. So let's say the blogger is traveling in Paris. So I'm going to write here Paris or maybe you can also import any other picture like for example, uh, Eiffel Tower and then um, probably here you can find the image that you like. For example, this one. So I'm going to take this picture, copy and then let's paste it here. Now I'm going to replace this as a background. I'm going to place this image here like this and probably I can also use the edit option that will help me to expand it. So let's go here in Magic Studio and here I'm going to use Magic Expand. And now let me expand this image up to here and up to here. Now let me click on Expand. And here we go. We have expanded this image. Now let me make a right click here and then go to layers and then click on show layers. I'm going to place my blogger in the front of Eiffel Tower and maybe I can place it here somewhere. Or maybe in this particular scene, um, this particular character makes more sense. So I'm going to place this character here and then I'm going to delete this one. So let me place it like this and then I'm going to click on download. So let's download this. Now I'm going to open Google Flow. And for those who want to get started with Google Flow and do check out the video link that I already have added in the description of this one. And now let's create consistent character. For that, I'm going to click here on frame to video. 
Now let me click here on this plus button and then from here we need to upload the frame, the character and the background. Now there is a reason why we have created character and background separately. We could have asked ChatGPT to do it because when we upload this character here, the view for the timing is not competent enough to differentiate character from background. So that is why I have added it like this. So in this way, uh, we have a transparent character and then we can create any kind of background and can ask VO to do the thing that we want. For example, um, in this particular case, again, I'm going to go back to ChatGPT and then I'm going to ask ChatGPT to generate prompt. Create a prompt for Google VO3, the latest model from Google, which I'm going to use in Flow where I have used the above character and then the background I have chosen is Eiffel Tower Paris. So do research and then come up with the prompt which is extremely detailed where the blogger talk about how we can generate consistent character like this. So I'm asking ChatGPT to create prompt for me. Since we already have added reference image, I'm going to paste this. And then here we also have option, you know, how you want your camera to move, which is really awesome, guys, because, you know, that's how further you can tweak it. And in this case, maybe I'm going to go with orbit right and let's hit OK. Now let's wait for a while. Okay, so here we can see uh, we have same character and let me play this video. People always ask how I keep my looks so consistent across all my travel videos. The secret is Google VO3. Its reference image features are amazing. People always ask how I keep my looks so consistent across all my travel videos. The secret is Google VO3. Its reference image features are amazing. People always ask. Now for the second video, now I'm going to click on here, which is jump to. And then I'm going to say here. Now the blogger is traveling to Taj Mahal. So the background needs to be of Taj Mahal, India. Again, by saying the same. Or I would say continuing what he said in the end, which is, you know, frame to frame consistency feature. Maybe here, you know, we he will have realization that look, the character remains same. So I'm going to copy this prompt again and then I'm going to go back here and then let me paste it here. So let me again click on go. And finally, I guess we have created the sequel of it. So let me play this. People always ask how I keep my looks so consistent across all my travel videos. The secret is Google VO3. Its reference image features are amazing. And somehow I've managed to keep the exact same vibe, outfit and everything from Paris all the way to India. It's wild. People always ask how I keep my looks so consistent. So this is a way, you know, how we can keep it consistent even despite changing the location. And now, since we already have created our character, we can keep on using it at a different, different location. So what I would suggest you is you can further uh, keep on creating your character in different, different getups as well as in different, different position and always download the character and use that as a reference. Now I'm going to go back here. What I'm going to do next is I'm going to click here on download. And in this way, guys, we can export the video. Now let me click on download. And there we go. So let's open this video now. People always ask how I keep my looks so consistent across all my travel videos. The secret is Google VO3. Its reference image features are amazing. And somehow I've managed to keep the exact same vibe, outfit and everything from Paris all the way to India. It's wild. 
So that's how guys we can create consistent character video inside Google VO3. I hope you find this video helpful and informational. If so, then please make sure you subscribe to Technoholic to see more such content. And I will see you in the next video. Till then, you take care and bye-bye.